Excellent. Now, what are these things? Jin, coming soon. Crafting guide. Jin statue. I need 20 marble bricks. Okay. Is there anything here that I want to make? Sa There's a lot of sandstone stuff. It's probably because I'm in the sandstone area. Uh, sandstone's easy to get, though. Sandstone mirror. I need iron ingots. How do you get iron ingots? Iron in the furnace. Okay. But I need some kind of fuel for that. Idyllic? Iron blade. Can I do anything with the iron blade? Social settings. My character. Coming soon. Okay. Island map. Coming soon. And social settings. Coming soon. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's one of the really cool aspects of this game. Okay, hold on. I'll talk about that while I uh, go get sandstone. Um, oh, it's getting dark, though. Ooh, monsters. Oh, come on, monsters. Maybe. We'll see. Um, so the multiplayer aspect in this game is very next-gen, in a, in a way. Um, you know how, like, one of the new things about what they're pushing with, like, the PS4 and the Xbox is there the um, Xbox one is uh, how you can uh, just jump in right you can, you don't have to like go through this whole big menu thing for the multiplayer you can just join their game when they're playing it and then uh, you guys can start playing together this game right I'm on an island this is this is my floating space island and as I play the game other characters or other players with their floating space islands will float on by as we're all flying through space at however fast we are and it could be your buddy's island and then you can just hop on over and visit what he's got going on and then um, the islands will pass each other and then you get back onto your island and then he goes away on his and you guys just keep floating on and I love that it's just kinda like da 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 huh? I'm just collecting sandstone oh what's that oh it's another island and then you just build your way across and then you can go chill with your buddy and then when the time comes when the islands move along then you can just get off and continue on your merry way and I think that's really cool let's head down I want to see some like there's that glowing rock stuff I want that I want that glowing rock stuff so uh, here we go hello glowing rock stuff nice and easy now what is this called this is glow moss could have called that I suppose uh, glowstone glow moss now, what I want to know is, I'm down here, right? If I do this, am I teleported back up to the top area? Oh, no, I'm teleported to where I jumped off. Okay, so I have to figure out a way to get back up. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, that's fine. Uh, uh, we'll probably just do this. Dum -da dum And grab granite. I see. I like how the default stone is marble. It's just, that's pretty nice. Is that granite? Uh, it must be. Right? No, it's marble again. It's just textured differently. Bizarre. I thought it was like copper or something like that. Da -da -da. So yeah, if you want a code to this game, you need to do a few things. One, you gotta be a subscriber. Not giving this code away to any Tom, Dick, or Harry that just happened to stumble across this video. You gotta subscribe. And then, uh, I know it's broken and all that stuff, but you need to leave a comment below. And, um, just whatever you want. Uh, you could comment the word Rosebud. You could comment, man, this game's amazing. I want, actually, yeah, that's what, that's what you need to comment with. You need to comment the sentence, this game is amazing and I would love a code. Is what the comment needs to read. And then, um, if uh, there's a bunch of them. I'll just stick y'all into a random number generator, and uh, the random winner will get. Uh, I'll send you a message um, if I can still do that through YouTube, and uh, with the code, and then you can um, put it into Steam, and uh, you'll be all set to go. You will be all set. So once again, the comment needs to read, "Man, this game is awesome," and I would really love the code. Is what the comment needs to say. I'm trying to get like back around to oh god I'm trying to get around to where my thing is like my staircase can I make this jump if I make that platform landable nope okay well now I'm down here okay this is not much better than where I was before dang it I need like a teleporter 
That's what I need. That is what I desire in this uh, in this game. I'm gonna use this granite and just uh. There we go. Or is granite the default stone? I don't know. I just don't know. Oh, that was a big one. See how long that one took? Ah. There we go. I'll probably give it uh, till Saturday for me to send out the code. So, uh, give people a couple of days to watch the video and get a chance to win. Will be the plan. And uh, I think right after my vlog go li goes live on Saturday, I will uh, look at the comments and do that. And if uh, nobody comments, then I'll just give the code to one of my buddies. And then they can have fun with it. Maybe we can try some of the multiplayer, but it doesn't seem like that's quite a thing just yet. So I'm sure later on in this game's development, I will uh, be able to take a look at it. But this preview period only lasts for four weeks. And uh, I'll be sure to send this video to them with my positive feedback because I am digging this game. It is gorgeous, first of all. Where's my moon? Moon? Uh, perhaps it hasn't risen yet? Or it's a new moon? I don't see the moon. Kind of bummed about that. Put a moon in. Oh, I want to see the moon. I love the moon. Uh, I need wool. I need chubby sheep. There we go. Give me your wool. I wonder how long that takes. I need one more bag of wool. Uh... You sheepy bastards. I'm going to have to go back down there, aren't I? Alright, well, I'll do that in a second. Anything I want to do to this house? I kind of want to raise the roof level, but it's kind of too late. Um, uh, well, let's throw down some of this because it's dark. Uh, yeah, that's fine. There we go. Ooh, that lighting is gorgeous. That is... That is something spectacular right there. Look at that. That is smooth lighting right there. Alright. Let's see. I've got some iron. That needs to go in here. Right? No, that's granite. Iron goes in here. I need fuel. What is fuel? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. Uh, tree bark? Can that be fuel? Aha! Excellent! Look at me. Doing the stuff. With the things. Now what is this? Drag blade material here. Okay. So we've got iron ingots now. Uh, we'll put those in there. Drag blade material. Is that drag item here? Maybe I need the blade itself. Just do that. Uh, blade? No, that's... Blade. Iron blade. Okay. Drag item here. Input. What item do I need to put in there? It's iron ingots, right? No? Did I just lose my iron? I can't get it back. Okay. Okay. Let's get the rest of my iron ingots. Uh, can I, I... Oh, here we go. So, when it's like that, I can't make it. But when it's like this, I can. So, is there anything I can make? No. Doesn't appear to be so. Alright. Well, let's go get that last bag of wool. And then I think we'll call it there for today. Yep. Or I suppose I could just do this. Since there's no fall damage. There we go. So one of these sheeps is going to give me my last bag of wool. And then I'm going to have my floor just be the softest floor in the world. There we go. Now let's head back up to our house. Oh! Crap. Uh, <laughs> falling. Nope. Get up there. There we go. Ha! Okay, now time to pay attention. There we go. There we are. 
Good show, old man. I played this game about four times at PAX. I kept going back and getting in line because I was really digging it. Um, one thing that they don't have in this build that they did at PAX was the Jin, the uh, J-I-N. They're like these little spirit doodads, kind of like this, kind of like the sheep. But um, can I do anything else with the sheep? Can I punch the sheep? I suppose not. Okay, and we've done it. An entire floor of wool. Oh, it's so soft. Oh, if only you could feel just how amazing this is. Oh, it's so good. Oh, yeah. Kind of kind of out to the elements here, so we're going to brick that wall up. There we go. Nope, reclaim is what I want to do here. Excellent. And the music plays. Ah, this is nice. Excellent. Well, that was Windborn. I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick look at it. I know, like, um, didn't really do a whole lot. Collected some wool, built a house. But, uh, there's still a lot of things for them to iron out. Like, I'm excited to see all this stuff. So, um, as this game continues all along in its development, I will do my darndest to bring you more content on it. Because it's really cool. I love the way it looks. It's got a heck of a lot of potential. I like the how the hand, how that's just like it's magic, you know, and that's um the shovel and the pickaxe and stuff. So it's a really cool creative tool for building. And um honestly, I kind of like that it's um it takes longer to get stuff. Like on Minecraft, you get the diamond pickaxe, you whizzing through the rock. But in this one, unless there's like hand upgrades, it like it takes it takes a little while to get some stone. You gotta gotta kind of think about it because um you can't just quickly get rid of things. You gotta be smart about your placement. You gotta really strategize, maximize efficiency, and all that stuff in this game. The game like the layout is really cool. I love the multiplayer idea. The sheep are adorable. The bags of wool are amazing. <laughs> the grass looks good, like really good. That's that's some solid grass right there. The biomes, I'm happy with the size of the island. I think there's quite a lot of for me to like look and explore and stuff. And it doesn't feel that small. I am curious to see if there's like stuff to explore, you know? Maybe uh maybe we should take a little wander. Let's just kinda walk around. Cause there's that over there. And um I'm just clicking. Can I just put down iron bars? Huh. That's huge. That was a big iron bar. Let's go over there. I want to see if we can wander the other end of the island. <sighs> T. Alright. Dun dun dun. Hup. Z? What is that? There's like this blue dust everywhere. Just kind of boiling out of the ground. And there's more sheep up there. Mm-hmm. And then there's that island. It's completely on its own. And I wonder if I can hippity-hop up in here. Come on. Come on. You got it. Come on. Nope. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Almost there. Ha. There we go. A lot of glow moss over there. And then uh, there's that. That's that's where we need to go. So we're going to use probably marble. Uh, let's head up here and see if we can build across. Possibly. Maybe. Time to carve our way through. There we go. This will also help in the building materials to build across to that tree island. I wonder if that's at, like one of the floating islands that passes you or if that's part of my island. Because it's not connected, so... Not sure. I love the textures in this game. The stones look fantastic. When you get close to the surface, they get kind of grassy. That's really cool. Okay, time to build across. 
I do like the fact that you don't need to see the side of the block. You can just click in the air where the block needs to go, and it's good. So there's no, like, holding you shift over the edge to not fall into lava or anything like that. You're good to go. Also, out on this. Oh, no, I've fallen. I've messed it up. What am I going to do? See? Totally fine. Totally fine. Kind of a lack of punishment in this game. Like, um... You don't lose your inventory. So, like, honestly, what's to stop me from just jumping off? But then there's really, like, no point. So, it's at this point, it's a pure creative tool. Like, there's, there's nothing that's out to get you. There's no kind of anything like that. So, it's just some trees. Some really strange-looking trees, but trees nonetheless. And, uh, yeah. Nice. Oh, aha. A uh, thing. And we go. Oh, it's just a fisher. And now I'm trapped down here. Alright, that was Windborn. I'm digging it. I'm excited for this game. I think this might be the next the next big thing. Uh in voxel based um cube placing games. This and Cube World, they're gonna they're gonna lead the way in our new Minecraft esque escapades. Yeah, this was Winport. I hope you guys liked it. Congratulations if you won the code, and I'll see you all next time. Have a good one, guys.